What up, Kennel Crew? We're back with number 14 on our 2021 Prism Quick Pitch 5-Box Series. Number 14, y'all. Good luck. This break went live in the store at 9 a.m. Pacific, and many of you were in early and often. You know who you are. Thank you very much for all the love and support. This one filled all throughout the day. Really appreciate it, everybody. Thank you very much. This is the start of a new case. So 14, 15, 16, and 17 will all be out of this case. So good luck. Plan your teams. Plan your work. Work your plans. Here we go. May the donuts be with you all. Good luck, everybody. McKinstry Diaz. A hollow Will Craig for the Pirates. A red Scooble to 99 for the Tigers. Scrub, Marquez, rookies, a Marshawn, and a Merrifield. Locker room is much more comfortable and much more spacious than the visiting locker room right now. As soon as Michelle said the guys are complaining how hot it is, Tony was shaking his head. Yeah, you got it. So, uh, in week 10, Sunday night football scheduled to be in Vegas. That's the next time we'll see the Chiefs on Sunday night. Take off the Raiders. The Raiders were there today taking on Chicago. John Gruden's been in the news a lot this week. We'll talk about that here momentarily. Mm, let me resend it then for you, Ryan. Hang tight. Carlos Correa, a Tommy, a blue Giolito to 199 for the White Sox. McKenzie, Anderson, Lodlow, Cabrian Hayes, and a Johnson. What up, all sports? Welcome. Welcome to the Kennel Crew. And we got our first gold of the case. Definitely inappropriate. Definitely immature. I thought he attacked the character of, of a man, but he apologized for it. He said it wasn't Rookie Kim for the Padres. Nice golden Kim for the Padres and Tibbs. Guzman, Colina, Bohm, and Erasmussen. What's up, Ball Sports? Uh, get oriented if you don't uh, with our website. It's where all the the transactions happen. Link to uh, all the remaining breaks for the day are in the top of the chat there. BulldogSportsCards.com. We got a football break going tonight. We also have a baseball, another baseball, two box random team. Haven, a blue Carew. Every week, this definitely will be one of the topics that will be addressed, and it will surely be addressed at length. There are some in the league office who believe that John Gruden won't be suspended by the league, presumably to fall under the personal conduct policy. But here's the reality. He wasn't working for the league or any of the teams. Larnach, a green Ricky. Condemning the email, but as a practical matter, this happened at a time when he wasn't employed by the league 
wasn't employed by any of his team, makes it very difficult for the league or the Raiders to do anything about it now. So that a silver Cespedes for the White Sox. A Ian Anderson to 40. Bronze to 40 for the Braves. Gallant, a silver Jeffers for the Twins. Pearson and a Carlson. Morris Acuna, a blue Matthews to 199. Our first auto of the break. It's a white donut. And that looks to be Tampa Bay or Marlins colors. Who's it going to be? It's for the Marlins. Miami is Papa Bear. The powdered donut Sanchez. Today I felt really comfortable. I felt like I could sit back there and what a box. Third reads at times. So um, like I said, I'm just I'm proud of the way the guys played and fought today. Um, we challenged the line this week to be better in the past. Powdered the donut game. Sanchez. And honestly, I thought they answered the, the challenge in my opinion. Nice one there, Papa Bear. And Oliva, a Marmalejos to 99 red for the Mariners. A Lynch, a Trey Turner for the Nats, Red Mojo to 149. The Kirk and the Low. Meadows, Jeffries, a blue Rizzo. All right, go grab spots in that football break. Go grab some spots in that football break. Howard, Kalenic, and Mateo. Turner, Count Busano, a blue Rasmussen to 199 for the Brew Crew. All right, box two of five. Good luck. Larnatch, Thomas, and a Pearson. Hendricks, a silver Yajuri, a Sanchez de 40 for the Marlins, a Maple Donut Sanchez for the Marlins. Fleming, 
never been over 400 yards with five touchdowns. You figured like one of the games against Buffalo. India, Stiver, a blue, a Rosarena for the Tampa Bay Rays. He's done that before, but he had not. I would have thought so. <laughs> he, was, he was red hot today. And we were in Foxborough last week and said, oh, you know, Bill Belichick, they played man coverage. They slowed him down. They did all those things. Uh, Miami, Brian Flores used to be at New England. Oh, he'll have the same formula. Not today. Coach, you said it before the season over, which was the Tampa staff felt like Tom Brady may have one of the biggest years of his career statistically when you start looking about the weapons around him and his second year in this offense at his Kirk. level now. Look at this. They go out and get Giovanni Bernard in the offseason. He's a weapon coming out of the backfield. How are you going to cover him? You can't cover him with just a linebacker. Paredes, we got a purple ice. Bueller, a butane. To 25. Nice purple ice there for Chris and Fanatic. A red, a cherry donut Kirk for the Blue Jays. Rizzo. Yeah, you're a little ahead of me. Aiken, a blue Scherzer to 199. Medina, a green Pedro for the Red Sox. Campusano, a looks like just regular silver lumber ink Yastrzemski. A blue Robert for the White Sox. Football mixer, fill in now. Go grab a spot in the football mixer, please. Luan Diaz, a Dan Peterson silver for the Mets. Larry Walker, oh, we found another powdered donut here. Good luck, everybody. Good luck, everybody. Another powdered donut. It's a rookie as well. Oh, baby. It's a very nice one for the Mariners. Seattle is Joe with the Evan White powdered donut. Holy smokes. Two boxes in. And we found two whites and a gold this case. Nice hit there for you, Joe. Meantime, Houston has lost four in a row. They're one and four. Mike Florio still questions about Deshaun Watson. What's going to happen with him as we get a little bit closer to the trade deadline? 23 days away, Mike. It's Tuesday, November 2nd at 4 p.m. Eastern. It's a trade period. And our auto, Until March of next it's year. to 49, 49 of 49 Expected for the Rangers. M. Kenrick with the Huff Blueberry Rookie Watson. Auto. The Adele. Awaiting whether or not someone will blink as we get closer and closer to November 2nd. There are off-field issues with Deshaun Watson that are very serious and are being taken seriously by the NFL. At 20 plus Tome, scrub. A Cassiano to 199. Going to eventually be looking into this situation. A ruling from the grand jury isn't expected before the trade deadline. That's a factor as well. But the Dolphins definitely interested. The question is, will the Texans soften their demand between now and and what's Anderson and then Adele we can add some water to it if you'd like sounds good right now the rain continues it has gotten heavier at Arrowhead they cleared the lower bowl 
because of the lightning in the area. So as we wait with McKenzie, a Goldschmidt red to 99 for the Cardinals. Kalina Tejada. This is why we break this stuff right here. What a two boxer. What two boxes to start, huh? Paven Smith, Guzman, a U Darvish to 199. It really is, and we've kind of talked about the month of September starting out total up and down performances. We thought Carolina was red hot, and Philly went in there. Things weren't happening on offense, but their defense actually held the fort down and let that offense get some rhythm. Defense, three turnovers, obviously the block part for special team contributions. All right, box three. Good luck. Taking advantage of some of these risky throws, and yet you know, this is why you go out and get a guy like, like Darius Slay. To make plays like that. The pass rush they've invested a lot in over the years. That's something that's really paying dividends for them. But when you talk about building a formula for what's going to be successful for this Philly team, good defense and a quarterback who is a dual threat, can do a lot of things for you, ran the ball very well today, has some explosive weapons. Nike Phil took the Panthers in the football mixer. One down, many more to go, but hey, every every team is a start. Help us out. Grab a spot in the football. But the mistakes by Darnold and in Immaculate Collegiate Box, two Origins boxes, and two Draft Picks Chronicles hobby. You really are. You had the lead. You had the momentum. And Sam Darnold made some dangerous, risky throws. A blue Abreu for the, for the Yanks. what's happening in the game. Your defense is playing really well. You know, so don't, don't give them a short field. Just, it's okay to punt, and it's okay to win the game 17-7, right, instead of trying to make some of these risky moves. Can we do story time here? Well, we have time, so we might as well. The Detroit Lions lost to the Justin Gonzalez Southern Garcia. The score of that game was 19-17. That was the same score of the game when Tom Dempsey kicked the 63-yard field goal, and they lost to New Orleans in November of 1970, which set the record for the longest field goal in such time. The Lions lost today in 1970. Guess how they lost? Chipper Jones to 199. Bart, Gonzalez, and Garrett. Oh, a nice one here for the Padres. Tibbs, the silver Cronenworth. A red Brandon Lowe. Patino. Dan Campbell's got a real thick soul. Listen to what he has to say after the game. When you see your players give all that they have and uh, and you lose that way, it's tough. A white, you know, you don't want that for them. a blue Peterson to 199. Um, but we'll be better for it, you know. And there again, credit Minnesota, but, um, you know, we, we made the one mistake that cost us. It was the easiest bit and the easiest hot take when he came out of his press conference and said we're going to bite people's kneecaps off. But you don't see a coach that emotional and sad five games into a Harrison and Marmolejos. Tell me what, what that was. Uh, well, that, that's emotion. That's heartbreak. 
but I'll say this. I love the way the Lions are playing. They're showing heart. And let me tell you, Dan Campbell, I went through the same thing my first year. We're losing games like this. We a green McKinstry. Games at the last minute, making plays to, to lose games. I remember walking off the field. That's to 100 on the McKinstry for the Dodgers. I thought we were supposed to be better. I'm never coming back to the game as long as you're the coach here. And I, I just walked with my head down. Nice blue Tatis. One year later, we were 5-0 and and in, in first place. 111 of 199 on the blue Tatis. Nice one there. They're playing better football, too. And you know him because you were in the same locker room with Dan Campbell. People forget he was the associate head coach for Sean Payton in New Orleans for the last few. But I, I, Young. I played with him the season 2009 <laughs> the offseason. So this man, this man played the game like he coaches the game. And I texted him after the game and said, I, I love the way your team fought. And, and he texted back, and I felt those emotions in that text message, which was, I love this team, and I love the way they fight. And with all odds stacked against them here as the season has begun until now, and and it, it, it's it's tough because they hey, haven't Crockett. been able to find a way to win yet. But to I, forty I in a Brayu. Trout and watching them fight and scratch and claw, just as he said, and, and I mean, I think it just epitomizes his mentality as a player and what he's instilling in them. Let me spin this quickly to Minnesota at two and three. They're two games behind Green Bay in the top of the division with Chicago having a good run here. You like what Minnesota's starting to put together without Dalvin Cook here two of the last three weeks. Jeffers. So close. Um, you know, nice green the judge for the Yanks. Fumble against Cincinnati, but they could have won that game. Adam Thielen, I still say, got interfered with in the end zone on the last play of the game last week. Right, right. They have the chance to tie that game up. They're they're right there. Now, they've, they've got to find a way to keep winning these tight games, but uh, this, that division, they're, they're going to be right in it. Vikings Rogers, a silver bets. A blue Ramirez for the Indians. Just heard from the NFL the update. They hope to have the players back on the field in about nine minutes. Optimistic that they can do that. 10:05 Central Time to kick at 10:15 Central Time. So that's 11:05 on the field Eastern Time, 11:15 Central. We see an official stop to Sean McVeary. That's a good thing. A Crockett for the White Sox, Silver, Jimenez, and a Cameron. Maybe there's more. Don't go away. We continue. Halftime, Bills lead by 11. This is good. Let's go to halftime. Let's go places. A Green Snell. Welcome to Allstate. Our auto is 60 of 60. It's for the Strohs. A Blueberry Javier, 60 of 60 for the Astros and Mike. Peterson and a Weathers, followed by a red Correa for the Strohs. Box four. Manoa Marmalejos. A silver Romero rookie for the Nats, a green Chris Bryant for the Cubs, and a Harrison. Gallon story, a cha a jazz, and an Abreu. Oh 
Morris Acuna. Erod Carew, Maple Donut to 40 for the Angels. Oliva, Castellani, Arihara, and a Blankenhorn. Sports and NFL apps. It is halftime Sunday Night Football. The Bills lead Kansas City 24 to 13. We've been in a weather delay because the lightning... Lynch, Verdugo, a blue Babe Ruth for the Yanks, Madrigal, and an Adams. Jeffers, Moniak, and a Sanchez. It was the Chiefs and Rich Gannon against the Seahawks right around the anniversary. It was six days and 23 years ago that what eight fumbles in this game, but eventually, bad moon rising. Andre, 80 yards from Rich Gannon as the Chiefs. Hey, Kalenic. To 99, a red Garrett Cole for the Yanks. Stevenson. Spencer Howard, we can't tell you Green McNeil, Oviedo, Evan White, a silver Bieber, a red Oliva to 99 for the Pirates. A silver mether weathers for the Padres. Mount Castle. A Schmidt. A blue Cal Ripken for the Orioles. Uh, no cases, Grags, no. Uh, at least not yet, anyway. I uh, do got the mixer tonight that does have two Origins boxes in it, though, sir. Our next auto is to 25. It's going to be a Padre. It's a Cronenworth. Boom. Boom on the Cronenworth to 25 for Tibbs. Wow, what a five boxes here. A hey, blue to 199, Bryant for the Cubs. Dahlback, Garrett, and a Kim. Vaughn Garcia, a rooker for the Twins, red to 99. Since uh, some hesitation and, and, and maybe just not really turning the ball loose like I know he's capable of. Mm -hmm. And I think that just takes time. They go to Seattle after a bye week. So the players are starting to come out. We're getting closer to the resumption of this very important game. The Bills ran 24 plays, scored 24 points in the first half, have a 24-13 lead, and they get the ball to start the second half. 
one highlight left. <laughs> Tennessee and Jacksonville. Of course, a controversial week for Urban Meyer after the viral the video Garcia. Viral of Meyer and a woman in a bar in Ohio after the game last Thursday. Trevor Lawrence played well. Jacob Hollister here for the touchdowns. Tight game early. You see some good things from Trevor Lawrence. He's growing every week, and they've got to repeat that game. But the Titans pulled away. Davidson, a blue Verdugo. For the Red Sox. How emotional, uh, emotionally draining was this week for you, considering what happened, and did you see any of that impact in the players at all today? I did it. I was you could have Sam. Uh, that I apologize earlier in the week. Excellent week of practice and put ourselves in a position to win a game at one point. All right, Mike Florio, bring you back in one last time here. What are you hearing out of Jackson? Uh, we, yeah, we've seen a Bart base or two for sure. Devers, McKenzie. In Cincinnati, and the players, the staff, I'm told, did not know he wasn't going to be on the plane. The people in the organization paying attention to two questions. Number one, was Urban Meyer truthful to owner Sean Khan when he was drilled last Monday when he showed Kalina up? Kalina Tejada, 199 Donaldson for the what Twins. Next? And that's a fair Carlson. You look at all the various things that have gone on as Urban Meyer has tried to make this transition in a very clumsy way from college coach to NFL coach, Mike. Tony, the plane thing, not coming back with the team, that's one of the first things you pointed out to me this week. I absolutely could not believe that, Mike. In 28 years in the NFL as a coach, three years as a player, you always expect your head coach to be there in, in the front seat, on the bus, or on the plane, wherever you're going. I, I did not understand that, and I don't know how that chemistry would be in the locker room. We saw Dan Campbell. I, I know Smith, how Guzman. Respond to that. How will they respond, Drew? To this situation with her. Well, it's tough because as a head coach, he, he comes in to try to change the culture, right, and, and create a new one, and you've got to be the one setting that example, and obviously this was not that at all. But at the same time, I think if I'm a player in that locker room, I'm looking at the other players. I'm looking Larnach, at the kids, Thomas, a gallon green. To bring the team together and say, you know what, guys, at some point this team needs to take control of itself. In other words, players accountable to one another and us playing for one another at the same time. And I think it, it, forget coaches. They they put together the game plan. Fleming. There's an element there, and there's a role. But at some point, the players look at each other and say, "Let's do this for each other." And I know you want the players to do that, and they should. But that's what the head coach is paid to do. That's Silver Nala. A Bregman to 199. Chicago Marathon was run earlier today. Our indie colleague Danica Patrick's running the Boston Marathon tomorrow. We've just done the halftime marathon, guys. Bills and Chiefs are back on the field. The Bills get the ball to start the second half. 24-13, Buffalo over KC. Stiver, Let's India. In half, up. And a Kirk. Let's go. Tonight, I'll be eating hot dogs with no onions. A George Brett Red for the Royals. Four Super Bowls, six AFC championships. You award winning customer service up to thirty percent off your auto insurance. There's a McCovey base for you, Jerry. And who else? That's all. USAA only for the military community. Florio Paredes. Machado and a Mateo. You're sharing our biggest, most foldable slices with extra cheese and pepperoni. But you're also sharing way more. You're sharing the chance to graduate college. Three meals a day. And a safe place for Correa, you to learn and grow. A Berrios to 99. And a Cronenworth. It's not just pizza. It's pizza with a purpose. Mm. How many bubbles? Friends. A Ramirez mojo. To 149 for the Indians. A Ralph Kiner to 99 red for the Pirates.
Hellenic. And an Oviedo. Campusano, Howard, Kettle Marte, blue to one ninety nine. A Diaz, a green glass now, and an Oliveris. McKinstry for the Giants, a silver emergent Ramos. The Daz Cameron to 40 for the Tigers. Well, the players are back. Fans are filing back in. They went into the locker room a little after 9 o'clock, so this is a delay right now of about 1 hour and 10 minutes. So the guys are warming up to get a 10-minute warm-up, and then we will be underway in just a matter of minutes. Meanwhile, the first half story. A silver Mark McGuire. Scrub Marquez, a blue Nelson Cruz to 199. And last pack of our five here. Fifty-eight of sixty. It's for the D-backs. A blueberry Andy Young. Let's do a recap. Five bucks, number 14 recap. Young, Blueberry, a silver, Ramos, Daz, Cameron, 40. Ramirez, Ripken, Oliva, Caruda, 40. The Christian Javier, silver, Betts, the green, Judge. The Abreu to 40. The Blueberry, Tatis to 199. McKinstry to 100. Silver, Cronenworth. Sam Huff, Blueberry, Lewis Robert. The Walker Bueller to 25. A Rosa Rainey to 199. The Mojo Turner. Silver Jeffers. Silver Cespedes. Had the Cronenworth to 25. The Golden Kim. The Evan White Powdered Donut. And the powdered donut auto Sanchez to five. Thank you for the fill, everybody. Appreciate the rip. Andy Reid, they have the luxury of being.